Let's check out what everybody's talking about here. Oof. You? Sure, Andre. We have not yet had Again? a moment to talk about what happened to you at that place. Oh, the temple. The temple? I am mm -hmm. not sure what to call it. In all my time amongst the stars, I have never heard of such a thing. What do you think that place was? You're asking the wrong person. Perhaps right now there are no good answers. Certainly it is too soon to speculate about who built it, but... How can we not? After what you experienced, do you have any insights? No. <laughs> I didn't see any visitor to censor or pick up a, a brochure if that's what you're asking. Yeah, we shouldn't take any wild guesses. If we keep going, we'll find out for sure. You sound just like Sarah. I see why she invited you to join Constellation. You are right, of course. And we'll learn in time. I am sorry. After what you have been through, I should be asking about you. Are you all right? Have you felt any side effects? Do you think there'll be side effects? Nah, I feel great. I'm a better. A person might suggest I'm a better that person. In itself could be a side effect. <laughs> but for now, we will just assume you have been very fortunate. The sure. artifacts, that temple, this new ability you have acquired, clearly they are all connected. This is all so much Probably. better than we realized. When this is over, we're all going to be rich beyond our dreams. Think credits are the first thing on your mind right now. You may wish to rethink your priorities. I gotta pay a mortgage. I am not sure they align with what Constellation stands for. Now we have even <laughs> greater reason to press forward. To learn more about what is at work here. Yeah. Andrea, please. Hey You're too righteous. What the heck is that? They're all guys. Oh no. There's a woman here, I guess. Go and get yourself a drink. It's time to party. Boone Morgan. Aren't you? Name's Boone Morgan, your new best friend on the here for a drink am i i mean are you i've got you covered. but if you're here for something a little more exciting we have plenty of aurora for sale wait so is aurora legal or not the astral lounge my friend in fact this is the only place authorized to sell aurora by order of administrator bayou himself and once you buy it, you can use it anywhere in the neon that you'd like. Except the spaceport, of course. Alright, I'm here to try that. What are we waiting for? What is that? Let's set you up. Here. Let's go. We'll take a look at the menu. Now I'm not going to lie. The Aurora is a bit expensive, but <laughs> let's face it. Can you really put a price on pleasure? Yeah. A penthouse? Oh, <gasps> I have a meeting here later. Word about security. The Astro Lounge is one of the safest places in all of Neon. Security is handpicked from the finest officers in the city. So I need to control the doors. Where exactly would I secure a meeting to take place? All right. Say I I need say I need security to be on my side if a fight broke out. Then I would say you'd be interested in the Astro Lounge VIP package. For a reasonable fee, our security can be your security. Okay. That fee seems a little we steep. We do strive for setting the most reasonable rate. Walter Stroud is coming personally. Surely that's enough to have security on Mr. hand. Mr. Stroud is coming to the Astral Lounge. <laughs> now that is interesting. Well, I think we can certainly offer a discounted rate for you if you were still interested yes would love to be Excellent. a VIP let me just apply that discount we discussed <laughs> done we do hope nice. your meeting goes to your satisfaction all right let Start me just check out the menu 
You offered Aurora, though, so. Where's it at? Aurora. Powerful and addictive hallucin hallucinogen derived from Voli Alpha's local chasm bass population. Legal only in the city of Neon. Slows time by 40% for 10 seconds. Wow, 684. It slows time. Like the Sandevistan in Cyberpunk. But why is it illegal? Damn. Alright, let's go. Hope to see you again. Ooh. <laughs> Are they dancing? <laughs> Energy weapons specialist. <laughs> too easy, too easy. There's a restroom. Can you? I just need the Jesus. I think that last drink was stronger than I thought. You're not doing a good job. Maybe you should slow down. Yeah, probably I'm It's a code restaurant? Holy oh, crap. Switch to water. What's up? Alright, let's go to the VIP area. Let's go to the balcony. Astro Lounge. Hey, what up, dude? Anastas has run into some trouble. Word to the wise, you don't want a piece of that. A booth. Tevin Anastas. Lounge special. I should be able to take whatever I want. I just paid it, like, to be here. Computer. Oh, again? Alright, let's check it out. Cool. So we got one. Two. Three. Four. Nice. Starware. Alright, remote door control. Okay, approved and signal will allow to use okay adding new user to remote door control override approved hand signal will allow use to lock door to vip launch to a total of one times nice this room has been booked by redacted please see boone morgan for scheduling conflicts nice all right so we got control so we got an override what is that? Melon melon caviar? What is this? Astro Lounge Special Sangria. Chardonnay. Chandra. Alright. I think we're good, right? Ready? 27. Let's keep let's, let's keep keep it steady. This is awesome! Alright, let's get uh, Stroud. We'll do what we gotta do. I gotta go back play Cyberpunk. I miss it. But, I mean, I'm not saying this isn't fun. It's fun to mess around with the NPCs, definitely. Let's check it out. Alright, Walter, let's go. Leave your lady here. Ready? It's done. Let's get this meeting going. The Astral Lounge and our cellar. Goodbye, my dear. See you at the next board meeting? Oh, I'll be keeping an eye on this little operation. Just in case. Good luck, all of you. Thank you. Don't worry, Issa. I'll be back for you. In an hour. <laughs> Let's go. Abby. Increase your max health 40%. Yeah. We'll do that one. We got a, a skill point. Since we can't really do persuasion yet fully, we need eight. 
Persuasion checks. All right, let's go. Right. Successful persuasion checks. Now, I don't know what the seller looks like, but they'll have a security briefcase with them, larger than normal, big enough to hold the artifact. We should split up. The code phrase to identify yourself as the buyer is Ramsey and Travers. You don't know what the seller looks like, it's huh? It's not like people who trade in stolen goods are eager to share personally identifying information. Hmm. See, I just noticed his buttons. They're like screws. It seems like they're screws. All right, use the code phrase to identify code the seller. Phrases? Got it. Under different circumstances, Walter, I think you might have made an adequate smuggler. Remember, Ramsey and Travers. We'll meet back near the elevator. Locate the cellar. How do I locate them? Mm -mm. Nah. He's staring at the wall. Excuse me. <laughs> what are you doing? That's him. Music is amazing. No, it's not him. He's a dumbass. Hmm. Him? Hey there. It was her. Alright, let's see if we can spot him from here. I thought it was him. Maybe the restrooms. Nope. Nobody here. Hmm. Could it be him? Over there. That's a janitor. What is it? Musgrove. See I'm busy drinking. That's him. Oh, really? I heard you all have a meeting in a few minutes, don't you? In one of those fancy VIP lounges? Speaking of we which, do. I gotta get going myself. Excuse me. Your excuse. Nice. We just saw our cellar walk by. Good job. Yeah, man. One step closer. You owe me all the money when this I is know, over. I know, I know. I'm leaning on you a lot. What can I say? You're a lie. That's what top performers are made of. Now, before we head in there, let me go over the ground rules. He'll ask for twice what we agreed on. That's normal. He'll probably try to walk out. That's normal, too. Don't worry about the amount we actually settle on. The Stroud Eklund Discretionary Fund is just a chip to you and me. Our goal is to get him to accept that ship in exchange for the artifact. Anything goes as long as it's in our hands. And we're not dead. How does that sound? We won't be dead. I'm keeping... I'm, yeah, I'm keeping my hand close to my weapon. Let's just try it my way first. Hmm? Remember that man is selling the artifact for a reason. He might be nefarious, but he might just be desperate. If yeah, everyone which walks is worse. away with what they want... I'll call it a success. It's more dangerous when you're desperate. Whoa. Jesus. All right. Let's go. There he is. So you oh, Stroud, Walter's here already. You look different in person. Our public relations different. always insists on doing some touch-ups for the official photos. Embarrassing. Your security here going to stand or sit for this little meeting, making me nervous. I'll sit. So polite. Almost makes me forget what planet I'm on. Am I to assume that briefcase has our item of interest? Yeah, here it is. Well, look at that. Mm -hmm. One of a kind. An artifact. And I know you want it. <laughs> I have the amount we agreed on. Uh-uh. Things have changed. I want double. Now, how am I supposed to do that? I don't know. 
But your security here seems to have some fancy gear. Why don't they chip in? Fancy gear? What are you talking about? It's a unisex uniform. <laughs> Remote triggers a door to close. We know you need to sell quickly. We can't just come up with double out of nowhere. Stop bluffing. We know you need to sell quickly. Oh, really? And how do you know that? Who talked? Does it matter? We know you're in a fix and we're still willing to buy. For the agreed upon amount. I got people after me, okay? I can't just set on what we agreed on. I need more so I can disappear. That's not our problem. We came here expecting one amount. Now you want another. You telling me Walter Stroud ain't got the cash? I'll walk out of this booth right now. <laughs> yeah, no, you you won't. You still need the money. I leave now. I can get a jump start on the people after me. Instead of you all wasting my time. You've got yeah. your way already if you just take the money I'm offering you and shut up. What's it going to be? <laughs> That's true, it's stupid. Walk. I ah uh, this stupid dumbass <laughs> please jesus christ please please don't take them <laughs> let me kill you um do the smart thing take the money all right you know you win hand over the money this thing oh is all yours i didn't even try to use persuasion well done some high pressure tactics but we got what we were after Time to go super home. high pressure shall we Yeah. What's going on? Let's get out of here. Stop right there. Slayton. Possession of Slayton Aerospace property. Ah. No, we're not. Slayton must have been the original owner. We don't need to do this. All's fair on Neon. Am I right? Hand over Mr. Slayton's property now, bro. All right, persuade. Oh, finally, I can persuade. Them. Don't do this. Don't die just to get the rock back. Get a rock it's back. It's my employer's property. That's all I need to know. You're gonna make me shoot. Yeah, okay. Let's try this. Give me a chance to talk to Slayton directly. We can sort this out. I'm listening. Neither of us wants to risk the worst happening. Your boss didn't understand what he had. No one has to get hurt here, though. I'm listening. For now. Huh. All right. All right. But Nicholas Slayton isn't a man you want after you. Good luck with that. It's fine. Sending on men to right. Astral Lounge. Slayton must be serious about getting the artifact back. We better get off the planet quickly. Slayton wants you dead. I would hop on the first ship out of here you can find. Buy you. If you have a complaint, go find Dex. You have money. You can talk to me. So you're in charge of Neon. It's any of your business, but yes, I'm the administrator of Neon. Actually, there are a lot of perks that come with the job. But He's you want an to asshole. know my favorite? One snap of my finger, and people who ask too many questions get thrown off of the upper platform. <laughs> I love that one. Does that mean your own the city? I wouldn't normally bother with idle chatter, but that's such a ridiculous question. I'm going to gift you with a response. I don't own Neon. Neon is the property of Xenofresh Fisheries, of which I just happen to be the CEO and the major majority stakeholder. Now, if you care to take a moment to dissect that statement in your tiny little mind, I'm confident you'll discover the answer to your question. Yes, yes. Whatever. Fuck you. Ace. Isa. Isa. has gone wrong, hasn't it? Slayton has put a bounty on your heads. He's greased a few palms. Your ship's been impounded at the spaceport. Ah, oh, fuck. our way out.
Who's this Nicholas? Sleep. of Slayton Aerospace. They're a systems mm. manufacturer. Engines, thrusters. Okay. How did they know it was Same us? Same way everything works on Neon. Money. It's terrible at keeping secrets. All right, whatever. Let's just get him off our backs. Have a talk with the man himself. Slayton Aerospace has offices here in the Trade Tower. If Nicholas is moving this quickly, he must be there or close by. Let's head to their lobby, shall we? See if we can make an appointment. All right, come on. Let's get over there then. Quickly, I want to get off this place. Or at least progress the story. <laughs> See what else we can get. It's late in aerospace. Wow. Hmm. Hey, girl. Welcome Riley. Welcome to Slayton Aerospace. Can I help you? It's a cute name. Persuade. I need to make an appointment to see Nicholas Slayton. Mr. Slayton is a very busy man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have an exciting business opportunity to discuss with Mr. Slayton. I'm sure you do. Fuck. Whatever. Okay. Believe me, Slayton is expecting oh, me. There does seem to be a hole in his schedule. Oh. I think we can make an exception in your case. Mr. Slayton will see you. Just use the elevator. Executive level access code added. What? I've been waiting all day. Yeah, keep waiting. <laughs> Wait. All right. This clearly is Ooh, Andrea. He's on to us. Walter. Uh, Fuck. Taking what's mine, then breaking into my office. A bold move, but one easily counted. Oh, we're trapped. Hello, Walter, yep. dear, are you there? Isa. Isa? Took longer than I'd like, but I managed to pay off one of Slayton's security consultants. They've patched me in. All right, we've got her out. Once the door's open, hey. just follow her instructions, okay? Hey, guys. This is nice. Uh, sure. I'm aware of the irony of me continuing to say it'll be easy. But it'll be easy. Doors will open in three, two, one. Slayton's guards and employees are all over. Be careful. Okay. You'll want to use the vent system to slip around unnoticed. There's a cover just to the right of the elevator you came in on. So this? That's a huge vent. Holy crap. Okay. That's the elevator you came in on. Jump right across the top of it and keep going to the end. <laughs> Is this their, their stealth mode? Cuttable wall. Okay. Interesting. Huh. The room below you is clear. Drop down. Ew. Stop. One of the doors leads you right into the open. I'm unlocking a safe route. Opening the door on your right. Go now. Head <laughs> don't go through the door at the end yet. There's a robot stalking the hole. Okay. Wait. It's walking down the hall. Go now to your horse to the door. Keep going. All the way to the end. <laughs> All the way to the end. Pay attention, listen to directions. Wait. There's people in the room up ahead. Close in the shop. I was about to open the door too. Okay. We good? Come on. I think we're good. Yeah, she closed the shutters, I think. Over here. Another robot up ahead. 
Wait for it to pass, Fuck. then head straight across to the maintenance door next to the security gate. Go now. Let me just get that for you. Shit. You know the routine. <laughs> Okay. Whoa. Damn it. Is it this way? Yeah. Okay. Down here? Alright, alright. to climb up the trade tower? There's a series of catwalks that lead directly up one floor to the executive level. Well. We made it. Kind of. <laughs> that was interesting. Oof, the catwalk. Oh shit. Just lane security. Fuck. Ah. Yes, wound. Whoa. What the fuck? What's going on? Why am I seeing blurry? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> it just got like... Alright. Alright, let's reload everything. Or whatever we have. I can't believe I haven't found like another shotgun yet, man. Like another shotgun type. We gotta go up. From where? I don't know. Maybe this way? Yeah. Yeah, we're going the right way. Go this way. We can't open that. We gotta go the other way. Nope. Oh, fuck. Quit. Bitch. <laughs> you didn't like him anyway? Okay. Bah, bah. Where's he at? Where'd he go? Did he fall down or something? Suppose I guess we gotta meet him. Like Sladen. Or do we have to kill him now? I doubt it. Sladen. You know, it's moments like this that really makes Neon the best place to do business. You mm. steal what's mine. I trap you in the city. You infiltrate my office. I lock it down. Where else can you match wits for the highest stakes but here? <laughs> <laughs> Call off your guards and release my you ship. You have what's mine. I indirectly have what's yours. We are at a stalemate. Although I do count a few more guns on my side. I wouldn't trust your, mer your mercs. They haven't stopped us so far. You do make a bold point. 
But that doesn't resolve our current dilemma. Perhaps I can help. We're both people of business, Nicholas. In the same industry, no less. Yes, I'm beginning to see the opportunity. There is, however, one final detail to disclose. Mr. Musgrove, my former employee, and the thief responsible for our serendipitous meeting, was caught prior to your arrival. I mm. think it would cement our new partnership if you were to decide on his sentence yourselves. Okay. <laughs> decide us in, we could let him go. He's a thief. Let the authorities deal with him. Clearly, you want him dead. I yield to your judgment. You've more than proven yourself capable of resisting any course of action I attempt to dictate to you. That seems a bit extreme for the circumstances. My security brought Musgrove to my office. I'm sure seeing you again will be a fine conclusion to your previous business. I have an opportunity to spare a man's life. I know he probably wouldn't do the same for us, but that shouldn't matter. Spare, bro, you got him into this shit. Shut the fuck up. Musgrove, damn, you got fucked up. Oh no, you. Slayton really does have a sick sense of humor. Here we are again. The poor judging the poor. Same old song, huh? You know how this works. Just make up your mind. I don't need to tell you this, but we don't need to kill him. We were taking advantage of his initiative after all. And we got what we wanted. We did. You're dead. You are dead anyway. Might as well make it quick. I will go in the middle. This is like the middle ground, but... Eventually he's gonna have resentment for us and he's gonna come back to kill us. That's how I feel. Then this one's gonna be like... Slayton's gonna come for us either way. And this one will actually show strength towards Slayton. Constellation is going to hate me. But. No one's going to. Get back at us. But anyway. If he tries to come back and kill us. We will. It'll be easy. But I'll do this. Everyone steals. But you got caught. You're going to jail. Doesn't matter. Justice for some huh? Fine. Yes. Rather be caged than dead. It seems you will have okay. plenty of time to evaluate that sentiment while you are in jail. I will make the arrangements for Neon Security to take him into custody. You're free to leave. Let's talk more back at the ship. This Nicholas. Is a good meeting. Very productive. Let's get to the ship and get out of here. Goodbye, Neon City. It was okay. It wasn't that bad. Let's go. A deal with a man who wanted us dead. I guess we can call that a win. What do you think? We got the artifact. That's all that matters. I agree. This life suits both of us, don't you think? Hopefully the I effort do. required here was unique. I do not wish to make a habit of this. All in all, a great success. Thank you for allowing me to tag along with Constellation's newest star. <laughs> Yes, no problem. I used a pun. Forgive me. Hilarious. But yeah, let's get out of here. Rare item, fiscal. Fiscal what? What did I get? 
Fiscal quarter. Oh. That's a that's a maelstrom. Bro, that looks sick. Alright, we'll see how much damage I mean not damage, but like we'll see how much it helps later on. Sarah. Oh, okay, let me take off and then we'll talk. I thought they were gonna run into the building. I'm like, what? You crazy. <laughs>